This is a garden that's been freshly mown today on the 6th of September 2009. Here are the grass clippings for proof. Um, this just gives you a better idea of what the patchy soil, patchy grass looks like on this um, really bad soil that they've supplied in our home. So I'll give you a close up. That's not how the lawn of a brand new home should look like. It's been actually worse than this, probably got better over the last 18 months or so. Um, the centre of the grass through lots of seeding and uh, liquid feed has improved but on these edges it's the uh, patchiness still persists. So I'll, I'll take you on a quick walk now. You can see here again. It's quite bad there. It's very bad here. And this grass gets at least twenty minutes of uh, watering with a time sprinkler every day so this is not down to it being a blazing hot summer and uh, it's very bad on this edge of the garden you can see it's quite poor soil to the council they've said it's uh, most likely got very little nutritional elements in the soil because it's uh, come from a brown field site potentially they don't know because they haven't had the documentation forwarded to them from Barrett, which they sh should have done. And that's despite chasing them for a year or so. Here you can see some seed that's been uh, put down. I don't think that will have any effect, but this, all these patchy areas have been seeded. Um, for the last 18 months, pretty much in the uh, spring and summer two or three times per year so you see the, the, the plants at the edge of the garden that bats put down to try and soak up the uh, water from the ponding that occurs and some on that side as well but, um, yeah from a, a brand new house but maybe it is when you buy barracks.